Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and Pokemon fans of the world, Mega Crasher is here, and I welcome you back to another episode of Mega Crasher Creates a Mega! Woo! In this episode, we go all the way back to Generation 4. We take a look at a Pokemon that has a very unique type combination of Dragon and Steel. It is also the master and the ruler of time! It is a Pokemon that is the mascot, the box art on Pokemon Diamond version known as Dialga. Now, this is a legendary Pokemon, and I'm thinking, you want to know something? Let's keep up with this pattern going by giving this Pokemon not just any sort of evolution, but a primal evolution. That's right, this crazy nuthouse is about to create Primal Dialga! Woo! Alright! Ladies and gentlemen, before we get on to the main event of the video, you guys already know the deal by now, we have to go over the regular Pokemon before giving it its Mega Evolution first. So let's go over Dialga real quick. So the typing is that of Steel Dragon, its abilities are that of Pressure and Telepathy, its HP is at 100, its attack and defense are both at base 120, the special attack is at base 150, the special defense at base 100, and the speed at base 90. Now these stats are all very good and make Dialga by itself a really, really powerful threat to begin with. But just what would happen if we push the envelope a little bit? Well. Pretty much to the point where we throw the damn thing out the window and give this thing a primal! Woo! Hot damn, friends! Okay, this design for Primal Dialga kicks ass. This design fits that concept perfectly. Especially given the fact that you take a close look at what's floating on its back. That looks a lot like Dialga's adamant orb, doesn't it? Can you imagine if it actually takes the Admin Orb for it to Primal Evolve? What an amazing idea this would be if Game Freak implemented something like this in a future Pokemon game! Holy shit, that's awesome! And we're just getting started, my friends! So take a look at the typing, it is going to remain the same as Steel Dragon, because why else would you want to change this awesome typing? It fits the design so well! The ability is going to be an ability never before seen known as Temporal Flux. Now what this ability does is it manipulates time and actually allows for you to use two moves in one turn should you be the last to move in the battle. So that means that you could actually go as far as using Roar of Time which is a Dragon type Hyper Beam and use the second turn to recharge and then you're good to go. So you use Roar of Time without any consequence. And you, that means that you could also use other moves like Stealth Rocks and then use a Dragon or a Steel type stab move and obliterate your opponents. This ability would be so broken. And we're not through yet, friends. The HP is going to stay the same at base 100. The attack is going to get jacked up to base 150. The defense boosts up to base 130. Special attack jacked up to base 180 and the special defense boosted up to base 130 and we're leaving the speed alone at base 90 that way it'll remain somewhat slow so that way temporal flux will be able to kick in more often than not and you will be breaking the metagame like it's no one's business oh yeah all right ladies and gentlemen that is going to conclude this special episode of Mega Crasher creates a Mega! And even though technically speaking, we did not create a Mega, we created a Primal. A Primal in the form of Primal Dialga! Woo! If you enjoyed this video, make sure you smash the shit out of that like button. Let's see if we can keep that like goal hype going at 15 likes! If you want more content like this, make sure you rate, comment, share, share, share this video, and subscribe today! for the best Pokemon Sun and Moon news hype that there is today on YouTube cause Mega Crasher and the community were hyped as ever before. And you already know the deal about it my friends, when we're a community type pack and Titan is one, you know that we shine brighter than the sun and the moon combined! So thanks for watching, 
And don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to see this crazy nuthouse create a mega evolution out of one of your favorite Pokemon, then simply put, all you gotta do is leave your suggestions in the comment box down below, and I will do the best I can to make sure that you get 100% satisfaction. Guaranteed! Oh yeah! So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next upload!